All right, hello, thank you for joining me. This video is gonna be super short, super short. Um, I stole these problems. I'm a stealer. It's one of the best teaching techniques, steal stuff from other people and use it in your own class. So this video is gonna be short to the point on how to classify angles based on their degree measure. And if you watch the classifying angles video, there's four types of angles, acute angles, right angles, obtuse angles, and straight angles. Acute angles are between zero and 90. A right angle is exactly 90. An obtuse angle is between a right angle and a straight angle, so between 90 and 180. And then a straight angle is 180 degrees. So what I would like for you to do right now, if you're watching this video, is maybe on a separate sheet of paper, is write down one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and classify these ten angles um, based on these. And then you can resume after you've done that and see if you got them right. So go ahead and pause right now. Okay. All right. Well, if you pause and you tried them, I'm hoping that you have resumed if you're listening to me talk right now. So okay, I'm just gonna get into this. Stop being awkward. Okay. So this 97 degrees is between, it is between 90 and 180. So that makes it obtuse. So this one would be obtuse. A 90 degree angle is a right angle. So this would be right. 98 is again between 90 and 180. So this is obtuse. This is also between 90 and 180, but cutting it really close, but this is still obtuse. This one is between, let's say we got zero degrees up here, which is not an angle at all. So between zero and 90 is acute. So this one would be acute. This one is exactly 180, which now is a straight angle because it's basically a straight line. So straight. This one is also between zero and 90. So this one would be acute. Between zero and 90, so acute. And then acute, and then acute. Like I said, it was gonna be a super quick video. You should be, it should be so quick for you to be able to classify an angle based off of having this information. If you need to write this information, down in your notes. If you need to write it down when you're doing problems like these, you should just refer to this and then super quickly be able to do this. All right. Um, I hope this video was helpful. I know it was short, quick to the point, but I do hope it was helpful. And I hope that if you pause the video and tried that, I hope that you got it right. And if you didn't get it right, I hope you understood now where you got it wrong. So thank you for watching. Like I said, I hope you found it helpful and I hope you watch more of my videos. Thank you.